Hi friend, this is Sanjay Kumar, Selectors of Creator. In this video, we'll see how Selectors of supports Cellulom elements and what are their limitations. And if you face any issue, I hope this video will help you to resolve those issues. So uh, let's directly jump into the demo. You uh, you just open your website and like as normal, just right click anywhere, click on inspect, open your dev tools here on the right side open selector sub if the element will be inside shadow dom in selector sub you will see it will highlight in blue color blue black background if it is outside shadow dom it will be like in uh, this orange color so now let's say if any element let's say we inspected this element and now okay we got to know that this is inside shadow dom you can uh, you can see that enter CSS selector only as xbar doesn't support for shadow ROM ok so you know that xbar doesn't support for shadow ROM or vice versa like shadow ROM doesn't support xbar and one more thing I would like to highlight here that selector sub is the only tool or you can say solution which supports for shadow ROM elements in fact like your dev tools doesn't support for shadow root elements so now see uh, if you just start typing so as it doesn't support for xbar so there, it will not suggest anything for the, when you will type double forward slash so just type app header and hit enter okay so we got one so this is the css selector we wrote now see if you copy this and command f press here it is showing as search but when you will complete as a CSS selector it will not show anything let me show you how if you type here and hit enter ok now you copy this and paste it here so you see that in div tools it is showing 0 of 0 it is not it is not able to verify the CSS selector for this one here in dev tools ok now let's uh, inspect some other element so you will see that if any element will be inside shadow root it will highlight here and you can see you can identify this is the shadow root that this it means this is close this is close this is close this is. so this input is inside this shadow root okay so there are actually multiple so no problem it will support nested one now here it is the let's say id is input so what you do you just type hash and input there you go so this is how you can uh, like quickly get to know that this toolbar toolbar if you if there are more matching nodes it will suggest uh, it will show all the all of them like two matching nodes and it will list it and it will also add css is equal to one css is equal to two like number of occurrences like at which place so this is the first matching node this is the second matching node likewise now here it is a there is a catch and limitations uh, from the shadow root concept itself like there are two types of shadow root one is open so you see that all these shadow roots are open shadow roots so basically we can inject the javascript inside that if you see the mdn, MDN web docs so here you will see that space where it's mode so there are two types of mode for shadow root open and closed if it is closed then we won't be able to like the shadow roots implementation internals are inaccessible and unchangeable from javascript so we cannot access them so basically we can support as of now we are able to support only those shadow roots which are from open if it is closed then it will not uh, support so you will see a random behavior here from the selector sub so basically like uh, if any element which is inside shadow root which is closed we won't be able to uh, support them select us as of now we are working on it to solve this problem but yeah right now it's, it doesn't support for the uh, like very obvious region because that's the concept actually but we are trying some hack so yeah so here if you see like if you type SVG so this will not be able to verify here so you see it is not it has not added CSS 1 or CSS 2 anything all these SVGs are, SVG are outside shadow root, shadow root not this one it is not this one 
okay so don't get confused like if you say see that it is showing me matching notes so it will not it is not the same one okay here if you type something you see that it's not suggesting its attributes so basically this is outside one if it will be the, this one then it will it will not support you see that if you type path here it's not suggesting anything auto suggest is not there so if it supports then it will start suggesting the auto suggest that means it's not supporting so don't get confused like if you found some matching notes so that means those are from outside of set group okay so i hope uh, this makes sense to you and i will leave this uh, link in the description so you can uh, read more about it like how the what are the concepts of set rules and uh, yeah if you have any question any doubt like feel free to reach out to me connect directly with me here on slack and if you have any question or anything uh, if you found any issue basically like you can raise it here on git so here you can directly chat with me on uh, selector sub slack channel anytime feel free to make me any issue raise here i i would request you please add your review here and share it with friends and uh, like community so it will help and uh, like those who are still facing problem from the day one the web was invented there was no uh, tool or anything which supports cdrom so this is a very fresh innovation i hope like it will solve millions of uh, problems for millions of people and saves a lot of time for everyone don't forget to share it on uh, like you can share it on social media so that it reach out to everyone and yeah with that thank you thank you so much